Hello, my name is Teresita Blanco, the artist sister. No, uh, well, I am the artist sister. My name, that's not my whole name. <laughs> okay, uh, and today we're doing ink cards. And I'm not using alcohol paper this time. I downgraded to a, what should I call it, to regular drawing paper. If your paper says drawing, that, that's the type of paper this is. And the reason why I'm doing this is uh, because I ran out of ink paper. <laughs> so, I, so I'm looking for alternatives to, to ink paper. So that I don't gotta go, so I don't gotta like go by. Oh man, this thing fell to the side. No. Oh, okay, good. I mess what's it mean? Like I'm looking for alternatives to to ink paper because I don't want cause of budget budgetary concerns. Yeah, ink paper is expensive, honestly. Yeah. Well, it depends on uh, expensive is relative. Okay, quality ink. The one that we're using before that we got from Pixis. Yeah. Well, and now we're out and uh, we could really use another sample. <laughs> yeah. Because I was still waiting for, well, depending on when you watch this, we're still not monetized yet on YouTube, so yeah. Our supplies are expensive. We are one quarter of the way there. Yeah, so if you can like and subscribe and share it to all your friends, you'll be able to see more, more amazing uh, uh, sea slug art like this one. <laughs> if you're crazy about, so if you're as crazy about sea slugs as I am, you know what to do. <laughs> also, don't send us any nice sea slugs. We, we just like the pictures. Well, yeah, the, the live sea slugs are poisonous. <laughs> Please, you see one, do not touch it. Leave it alone. Yeah. Uh, like, uh, it, it may look a little bit like a jellyfish, but once I add more details, it's gonna, it's gonna be a sea slug. You know, in fact, sea slugs eat jellyfishes. They are, that's why it's poisonous jellyfish to be more exact. In fact, that's why, that's what gives them their poisonous. They're not naturally poisonous, but they eat poisonous creatures to become poisonous, you know. This one specific, like, they like to eat like the man of war, you know, like the ones that, the ones that really mess you up <laughs> in the touch you. Doink, ah! It's the center up there? Yeah, 100%. Like I centered it before. Well, you should still share cause, uh, if you Oh, paper moved? Yeah. I see a center. Ah, oh, good. Muy bueno. Perfect. All right, okay. Very interesting. I guess that I dangled into drawing paper. It's a little... The paper looks like it's suffering. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so far, the mixed media paper is the one that's doing the best. Yeah. Because it doesn't absorb the inks enough to... Yeah. It doesn't absorb the ink enough to like screw it up, but, you know, it, but still maintains control. But still, this one is very nice, you know, I, like, yeah. Uh, you can live with drawing paper. Oh well, yeah, we do accept donations for our supplies, fixes, or anything. It's man, you have a, you have a, you have, like our, like our mail is in like, uh, like, do we have an actual address in our website? Yeah, I think it is. No, they don't add it in the description or something. Yeah, that's our supplies. <laughs> we could really use more our supplies. We can do more RC sister things. So yeah, subscriber count is almost over nine thousand. Like. Yeah. 
Well, it depends on when you watch this, man. Maybe, oh, yeah, maybe when you watch it, we're already on a million. Can you imagine? That would be awesome. Mm -hmm. More than a million is a good reason to use that money. They hate you, girl. Tearing us apart, Lisa. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, we actually did watch uh, the room, that movie. <laughs> I don't know why people say that they found it hilarious. <laughs> was it supposed to be funny? I don't know. I think it was supposed to be dramatic, not hilarious. But it, it, Whatever. They're really good at comedy. You just don't know it. <laughs> yeah. Like, if you watch it as a ridiculous uh, wrong con comedy. Like a, like a deconstruction of a... <laughs> <laughs> like a parody of a romantic movie. Yeah, and then it, then, it, then it works like uber well. Like, I'm pretty sure that's not what they were going for, but that's what they did. <laughs> And then with the fingers to the device, right? No, it's darker blue uh, on the center. Oh, right. Okay, that's uh, It's gonna get darker blue soon. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to preserve as much of the other type of blue as possible. Like if it's from lighter to darker, it works, but if when it's like from darker to lighter, I'm like, difficult. So it's best to be as precise as possible. Yeah. I just treat uh, this ink, like, uh, just treat this ink bottle like a, like a pencil and be careful when you tip it up and down because uh, it may like drip a lot. And then if you need more, just squeeze it a little bit. A little bit. My god, this precision is born from practice, from a lot of practice. Yeah, we've been making Inca for almost two years now. Yeah. See, you gotta do it like, like Van Gogh, he didn't like go to school. He, he just sat down with a, with his paint and then he just painted until he got good. And that's a legitimate way of going about learning how to paint. Just uh, bash your head into it until you figure it out. Until you find your own style that is sound the same unique to yours. The school can only get you so far. Even uh, all of the masters, they, they eventually had to like they go to school work and make their own stuff. Yeah, I mean, I mean, she was big on experimentation. Uh, Gustav Klein, uh, the stuff he made in school doesn't look anything like what he ended up painting. What he ended up painting. Mind you, he was really good at sketches. Like I I've seen his early sketches. They're they're amazing. Yeah. He doesn't like to draw feet. Yeah. Feet frustrating. He's like the anti uh, Quentin Tarantino as far as the food department. He showed with the Clint a foot and then he was like convulsed or something. Mind you, be commendable that you were able to show Gusta Clint a foot because he did. <laughs> Which one? So yeah, this is an actual creature that exists in the world. Yeah. It is jellyfish. Yeah, it's not a jellyfish, it is jellyfish. It's the bane of jellyfish. The hunter of jellyfish. Dun, 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 dun. You know like the hunter or hunter from Bloodborne? Well, this is the hunter of jellyfish. And possibly one of his cousins showed up in Bloodborne. 
to blab on so all about weird marine life. Alright, we're done. Bye bye and God bless.